Hey guys, it's Katie, and today I have the Riverdale tag for you guys. And if you don't know what Riverdale is, please go watch it. It's on Netflix. Please go watch it. Please, 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 please go watch it. Do me a favor and go watch it, and we can obsess about it together. Yay! Um. So yes, I'm gonna be answering questions about Riverdale. So let's get into it. Okay. Question one: Favorite character, Jughead Jones. Come on, guys. Come on. I just spill that everywhere. <laughs> um, question two, who's your least favorite character? Oh, it's hard. Okay, so if you guys follow me on Snapchat, you would know my least favorite character switched a lot. So probably at the end would be, duh, at the end would be, um, oh wait, no, I can't even say that because it would spoil it. Uh, shoot. Um, really throughout it, one person who was my least favorite character was Mrs. Cooper, but once they explained everything, I liked her again. I liked her. So, Josie! I hate Josie. I just can't stand Josie. Uh, question three. Team Juggy? Team Juggy. All the way. Screw Archie. Forget Archie. For Archie's nothing. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really don't like Archie, but, uh, seriously, Jughead's my everything. Uh, question four. If you were to be one of the characters from the show, who do you want to be and why? Uh, Veronica A, because I love her, like, fierceness. She is so confident. I love how she is so there for her friends, because I am that way, too. She's so loyal and... Like, well, I guess she's also my most relatable character. Her and Betty are, like, me combined. Um, besides Veronica, I would want to be Jellybean. Like, I want to be Jellybean so badly. We don't even know who she is, and I want to be her. <laughs> um, question five. Have you read the comics? I have not. I might have seen them because I used to read those comics, like, co like comic strips in the newspaper when I was younger. So I might have. Don't know. <laughs> question six. Who's your crush on the show? Jughead. Jughead! And if, uh, and Veronica, if I, like, went, if I was into girls. Uh, who's your, yep, no. Question seven, what was your first initial thought of the show? Did you change after you started watching it? I, I thought it would be awesome, and it was so awesome after I watched it, so, yeah. Um, eight, whose clothing style are you most, like, uh, probably Betty, since I wear pink a lot, but, like, Veronica's, and, like, uh, I don't, see, like, that's the thing! They don't dress like actual sophomores! Guys, I was a sophomore. I'm a junior now. But, like, I was a sophomore. I know how we're supposed to dress. None of us dress like that. That is what we call a TV show when they actually have someone who design, like, picks out outfit for a living. Like, they do that for a living so they know exactly how to piece it together to make it look spot on. So, I don't really know who I dress like. Probably a mix of Betty and Veronica. Because... Yeah, um, and I know one at a time. Probably Jughead, because I wear... I love beanies, which this is cutting off my circulation. Uh, question nine, who's your favorite parents? Oh, Mr. Andrews. I, I love Mr. Andrews and ending. <laughs> Sorry. A bottle. Okay, question 10. Who do you ship most? Oh my gosh, guys. I could write an entire book on why I love Buckhead, even though Cole Sprouse is my husband. He's supposed to be my husband. But I love Buckhead so much. Let's talk about it. Let's have a good group therapy session on why I love Buckhead. Please. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Okay, uh, that should be one of the questions. What's wrong with Katie? Why is she so obsessed with Riverdale? When I talk to people, there's no conversation. She's like, girl, have you seen Riverdale? Have you not? Okay, you gotta go watch it now. <laughs> That's literally what I do to say to people now. So, <laughs> I'm going insane. Cheers. Okay, um, question 11, now that, okay, this is spoiler alert for anyone who has not seen it, so go away now, go away. <laughs> now that we know who killed Jason, who do you think it was before we found out? Guys, to be honest, like, this is actual full honesty, I didn't think it was anybody, like, I didn't have my suspicions, uh, I can tell you who I didn't think it was, I never thought it was Jughead, never thought it was Betty, never thought it was Archie, never thought it was Veronica, well, obviously Veronica, no. Everyone always, like, I, like, I, I, like, see all these videos on the internet of, like, all these, cr like, I've never watched any of them, but, like, all the theory videos of who did it, and I'm just like, good lord, <laughs> and I bet all of them are, like, that meme where it's like, calculating like I can just see it's just like some craziness I did think it was Cheryl Cheryl was definitely one of the people I did think it was but other than that like I'm not one of those people usually I am like with TV shows usually I will try I and I'm usually I'm correct but with shows like this and like Pretty Little Liars I try not to like figure it out I mean Pretty Little Liars I did but like obviously it showed us who the killer was so I really like I yeah I just this show I didn't okay like I just didn't 
go math science into it. I don't, yeah, I just didn't. I just, I had my suspicions, but yeah, I just really didn't know. I was just like, oh my gosh, who did it? Like, all these people look so nice. It ended up being a guy who was like kind of obvious, like it was kind of obvious that like he would do it. He had all the motive and everything. I'm not going to say who it was, but. But yeah, so I love Riverdale so much, guys. Please go watch it if you have not seen it. It is on Netflix, and it is amazing. All the actors and actresses are amazing. And I can only, I dream about being on this show. I, you guys know I want to be an actress when I'm older. And all I can, I'm good. Girl, maybe one day I'll be on the show. But yeah, so I hope you guys are all having a great day. I love you all so much. Sending all my positive vibes. I know Shannon Rose says that, but I just love how she says that because it's true. You should send your positive vibes out to other people. So I'm sending you guys my love and positivity as Sh Shannon always does. And I'm sending so much love and positivity to Shannon Rose right now because she's pregnant. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for her. She's going to be an amazing mom. Her and Travis are going to be amazing parents. I just know it. I, you can just tell by them. That they are just so amazing. I love them so much. Much, and they're just beautiful amazing people you just know they're going to be amazing parents and I'm so excited for that they've tried so hard for this and it and it's just awesome and they deserve it so much but yes I am so excited for them and uh can, big congratulations Shannon if you, and Travis if you guys ever see this video and yes I love you love you guys so much and I hope you guys are having a fab fabulous day wherever you are and please go watch Riverdale please uh like Instagram me, Snapchat me, Twitter me, please just come to me and be like, girl, I watched it, let's obsess together, because it is my everything, and seriously, I've just, like, every conversation I've had with people, I've been like, have you watched Riverdale? If so, if, like, if not, go watch it, Netflix, honey boo, go, 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 and if so, hey, <laughs> Jughead, though, Jughead, but yes, so I love you guys so much, and if any, if, for some reason life just wants to be nice to me if any of the Riverdale cast ever sees this video ever in lifetime I love you so much you are so talented and amazing and I love you and I love 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 your show so much okay love you guys bye p.s. I'm literally watching Riverdale right now he re-watching it I'm on the, uh, episode 5 because I'm re-watching